The overall goal of this procedure is to express new proteins, such as ion channels, in Xenopus oocytes. This method can help answer key questions in any field that requires a functional expression system. The main advantages of the variations of this technique are the speed, reliability, and improved survival of the oocytes. This method can provide insight into functioning of ion channels. Additionally, it can be applied to the study of any other protein. We first had the idea for this method when we realized that classical methods resulted in a low rate of oocyte survival. After removing the lobes of the ovaries from female frogs according to the text protocol, place the lobes in sterile modified Barth solution supplemented with penicillin and streptomycin. Cut open the lobes to allow access of the tissue to oxygen. To single out stage 5 to 6 follicles, use forceps to hold the ovary and then lower a platinum loop over the follicles and gently withdraw the loop to disrupt the connective tissue with the follicle from the ovary tissue. Sort out healthy looking oocytes using the platinum loop. Use a plastic Pasteur pipette with the tip cut to a 1.5 mm diameter to transfer selected follicles to a 35 mm diameter petri dish. After preparing cRNAs for the GABA-A receptor and microinjection pipettes according to the text protocol, use paraffin oil in a 10 ml syringe with a thin needle to